very hard to cool down while we waited for Coot Boot to return from Uncle Bill's lobster scape deep under the Pacific Ocean. <laughs> it was so hot I needed a glass of water. Oh, what on earth are you doing in there, Nobby? Just trying to keep cool. Just then, I saw that Coot Boot was returning at last. He looked even hotter than the rest of us. He was even finding it difficult to fly. Oh, no, not on me. Poor old Coot Boot. Walter, Walter. Oh, that's better. Well done, Nobby. Uh -huh. Dr. Snuggles, I've just come all the way from Uncle Bill and there's something terribly wrong. There's hardly any water anywhere, not even in the river. It's all gone. All the water? Gone? Oh, well, what's gone wrong? We must do something. Yes, we must. We must go and find what happened to the water. Come on, everybody. Nobby, Dennis, Coot Boot. Well, where are we going, Doctor? We're going to look for a river. It's missing. Missing? <coughs> Stupid frog. We followed the course of the dried up river to the very top. And there we found it ended in a cave. It was very dark. And there, in the corner of the cave, was the river, rolled up like a carpet. What on earth could it be doing? Good afternoon, my dear Scream. I am Dr. Snuggles. <laughs> oh, come on now, my dear Scream. There's no need to be nervous of me. I've come to help. But I'm frightened. I don't want to go out on my own. I told the nervous river how important it was that he should go out this afternoon as usual and told him how all the animals and flowers were in trouble without him. Besides, if you don't go out, You'll never meet the sea. I don't want to do that. I'll disappear if I do. I know I will. I assured the river that this was not true and that we would keep him company on his trip and look after him. This seemed to work. Yeah, yeah. Now, uh, dry your eyes. Uh, oh, yes. <laughs> Silly me. <laughs> well, come along then. There's no time to waste. Come on. When I chatted to the river as we went along, and it began to cheer up. <laughs> and soon we began to get up speed. I was finding it difficult to keep up. Oh, thank you, Dr. Snuggles. Even on my umbrella it was hard going, but Nobby had an even better idea. We made splendid progress. The river seemed to be doing everything, a power of good. And at last, we reached the sea. I told you, I told you I'd disappear. What do you mean? The river was right. Someone had been making the sea disappear. 